What's up guys, it's Davey here from PhoneBluff.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to configure the universal search feature on your Android phone. So as you can see I have my search widget right here at the top of my screen and to actually configure what it searches through, so basically instead of having to search just the web and the default applications it searches, I could actually decide which one it searches by tapping on the text field, hitting menu, and then tapping on settings. After you hit settings, go to searchable items, and then you can check or uncheck the apps that you want the universe search to search through. So for example, my apps are checked, meaning that when I search for an app I have installed on my phone, it'll find it. Um, I can have it search through my browser history, but I don't really want that. I have it checked to search through my color note, which is my note application. Um, my messaging is checked, so that way if I'm looking for a specific text message somebody sent me, like you know when to meet them up or an address, I could actually search for that, which makes it a lot easier instead of scrolling through threads. Um, my people is actually unchecked right now. I'm just going to go ahead and check it. And then uh, Play Roll, I'll leave checked. And Player Pro, my music app, I'll leave checked. So now I'll go ahead and show you how to actually use it. So for example, let's say I'm looking for a song. I can just type in, um, let's say, Headlines is a song that I have on my phone. And uh, so these are actually the words, are the songs that all have the word head in it. So I'll type in L. There you go. So now you see Headlines there. I can just tap on it, and it's going to start playing the song. I can go home and search for something else. So let's say I'm searching for a particular app. Let's, just, I, let's say I want um, Chrome. So I guess I C-H-R, and you can see Chrome comes up right away. So pretty cool feature, I mean, that, and it works through context. You can see my contacts are actually showing up uh, here anyway. And let's say I didn't want my contacts, I just go right back, go to settings, go to searchable items, and take uh, people off. And now when I go back, you can see that it won't actually search through that. So pretty cool functionality. If you wanted to clear your history, as you can see, I have history right here. I can just go, same thing, go to settings, go to Google search, and then just tap clear on device search history. Tap on that guy, hit clear history, and I'll go back, go back, and you can see there's no history there. But that's pretty much it for me in this video. This is Dave from PhoneBuff.com. If you found it helpful, please hit the like button and subscribe, and don't forget to visit PhoneBuff.com for more cell phone news, reviews, and how-tos. Thank you.